This video was created by Vinylic Puma of Vinylic Puma Gaming. Warning, vulgarity awaits. You know, it's been a long time. Things have been going pretty good for me lately, so I haven't had a whole lot of shit to rage about. But that ends today. I just found out that there are some really shitty pistols in Fallout 4. Thank God. Most of these weapons are unupgraded, but some actually are, and naturally, they're going to be higher up on the list than the non-upgraded pistols. These are the top six worst pistols and handguns in Fallout 4. And to quote a famous and perhaps vulgar video game hero, let's rip off some heads and shit down some necks. Hail to the king. Number six. The 10 millimeter pistol. You know, I actually don't have a whole lot of awful shit to say about the 10 millimeter pistol. Instead, I'm going to tell you some shitty jokes. Yo mama so hairy, you almost died of rug burn at birth. Yo mama so poor, her face is on the front of a food stamp. Yo mama so greasy, her freckles slipped off. Yo mama so dumb, she bought tickets to Xbox Live. Yo mama so fat and ugly, would she play Mortal Kombat? Scorpion said, stay over there. So if you've learned anything about 10 millimeter pistols, it's most truly a pile of fuck. Number five, the Institute pistol. As much as it pains me to say it, the Institute laser pistol is a piece of shit. How the fuck is the Institute the most powerful technological force in the Commonwealth, yet they have the worst laser pistol in the game? I mean, they have a goddamn army of T-1000 term- <clears throat> Oh, I'm sorry. Human-like synths. Yeah, Sean, I actually got it right this time. Anyway, seriously, how do you fuck this up? And it's a shame, too, because the Institute has the steepest upgrade curve, which improves the weapon damage potential by literally three times the stock version's base damage, and that's also without a scatter modification to turn it into a shotgun. What an ass clenchery Cleveland steamer-worthy, bucket loads of profanity, boatload of chicken scrap shit. Was that too long? Yes, you're probably right. Number four, the pipe pistol. Okay, so I've said that I like the pipe pistol before. Does that still stand? Fuck no. 13 damage per shot? What the fuck, are you kidding me? How the fuck am I supposed to kill anything outside of some fucking rad brooches and various birds and shit? Mama Murphy is full of shit, dude, because I can't kill a goddamn Deathclaw in one shot with the pipe pistol. I mean, it must be all those drugs that are clouding her memory. You'd be better off punching a Deathclaw to death in some power armor than using a fucking pipe pistol. What a pile of shit. Oh wait, I mean, what a pile of fuck. Number three. The flare gun. So some people have been telling me I fucked up by including the flare gun in my top 10 worst guns and weapons in Fallout 4. They said that the flare gun is meant to call the Minutemen, and is it technically a weapon? Well, if it's not a weapon, then why the fuck does the flare gun list any amount of damage? Why can I aim it at an enemy in VATS and hit them with the flare gun and deal damage? Besides, did anyone forget that the Minutemen you call are literally level 1 soldiers? Yeah, that's right, level 1 shitty soldiers. You're almost better off with the synth relay grenade. At least that's a funny way and funny thing to use to troll and terrorize the various settlers in the Commonwealth. I mean, really, unless you mod on the PC version of Fallout 4, there's absolutely no point in even taking the time to unequip your good weapons and equip this pile of shit. Vinylic Puma Gaming 1, the internet 0. No completionists, that one guy who video games or defend it's required. Booyah, bitch. Number 2, the pipe pistol upgraded to the 45 receiver. Wait a minute, Puma. Didn't you say that this is the 8th best pistol in Fallout 4? How could this be one of the worst pistols in the game? Did you actually fuck up the list? No, 
I never mess up. Don't ever mention such trees in here again. I'm always correct, right, precise, accurate, and infallible. About time you figured that out. Besides, fuck the pipe revolver. I will say that when it comes strictly to damage per bullet per shot, the pipe pistol upgraded for the 45 receiver is actually the worst option, even though it may have better DPS. Unfortunately, the 45 pipe pistol is worse than the pipe revolver stock, which only deals two damage per shot more. But rest assured, the pipe revolver isn't escaping this shitty guns list. Number one, the pipe revolver upgraded to the 38 receiver. What a boatload of Look at this pile of shit. This gun is actually worse than the completely normal fully upgraded pipe pistol. How do you fuck that up? The fully upgraded pipe pistol deals 19 damage per shot. The pipe revolver upgraded to the 38 receiver deals 18 damage per shot. To me, this is a total mindfuck as the 308 version of the pipe revolver is actually kind of good. I mean, how could you actually make the pipe revolver worse than the pipe pistol? It just seems impossible to me. I hereby decree that the pipe revolver might just be the worst pistol and handgun in Fallout 4. Anyway guys, that's going to pretty much wrap up this particular video. If you like this video, please be sure to leave a like. It's been a while since I've done a top worst video, so again, I hope you guys liked it. As always, take care and I'll see you all next time.